Thank you very much, Mr Deputy Speaker. I rise to raise concerns about plans by PowerCor to disconnect power to the Biragara township on Friday the 9th of June, immediately prior to the long weekend. The notice of power supply outage was delivered to the owner of the Biragara General Store, Cameron Williams, and other traders and residents with no consultation. I am told only the local school was consulted. The tourism trade in Biragara is vital. Biragara lies at the foothills of the Opways near the Great Ocean Road and is of course home to Bray Restaurant, one of the world's best restaurants. Tourism is a vital part of the local economy. Why is PowerCore not capable of implementing its power outage at a time which will cause minimum disruption and harm to traders? At one of the busiest times of the year, this will turn Biragara into a ghost town. Does PowerCore understand what this will do to food ordered for the long weekend that has to be refrigerated? Mr Williams estimates the cost to his business will be something like $2,500. He says, as a person who has put my house on the line to be a small business owner, it's a real kick in the guts. He'll be required to send his eight staff home. What's incredible about this decision, Mr Speaker, is that PowerCore made, made this decision in Forest last year on Easter Thursday, so they've learnt no lessons. I call on PowerCore to have some common sense, have a heart and reverse this decision.